and at a certain point this guy came up to the campsite and he was, I guess he was tripping on acid or something. He was just ramping, just scoop, blah, 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 scooby doo, you know, r r r just making shit up. And, uh, and he had this big, <laughs> like warm, 24 ounce, like Miller High Life in his hand. And uh, he kept talking about like his whiskey. I'm like, oh, my whiskey is so good and sauce. You should try some of my whiskey. And we're like, okay. And he would like hand it to us and we'd pretend to drink it and be like, that was great. And I was like, oh, no, my whiskey's so good. And uh, the last thing we heard him say when he walked away was like, how about the spooky wagons? And we were like, did he, just, did he say spooky wagons? Is that what we heard? And so that night we ended up all giving each other like campfire Indian guides names. And one of my friends was Spooky Wagons and I was Shaky Graves and there's Spinster Jones and Solomon Doors. And uh, my friend's little brother was asleep in the tent at the time. So we named him Droopy Wieners. And he came out and was very, very displeased because we all had cool names and he was Droopy Wieners. But, but uh, that night I ended up kind of taking my guitar out and playing for people for the first time in a long time back in Texas. It went great. It was just like this musical explosion. And afterwards this drunk dude came up and was like, what's your fucking name, man? What's your name? And then I decided to stick with it and was like, shaky graves. And I told, I guess, a few people that that night. And so the next night people were, oh, hey, what's up, shaky? I was like, that's, <laughs> that's okay. That, that works fine for me.
Thank you. 